With industry-funded science favoring just one mechanism by which radiofrequency radiation can cause harm to an individual, while ignoring all other mechanisms with a plethora of independently funded studies showing significant biological harm, while 387 scientists and medical doctors signed a 5G appeal addressed to the EU calling for a halt on all 5G technology, with countless others whose concerns fall on deaf ears. While experts in risk management express serious concerns of unprecedented threats to privacy and national security, telecommunications companies and cell phone manufacturers selling wireless devices with small print warnings to keep the device at least one inch away from the body at all times, and insurance agencies refusing to provide cover for injury caused by said wireless devices. Meanwhile, the parliamentary inquiry into 5G was dominated by wireless industry representatives, with clear prejudice against medical professionals and concerned citizens alike while simultaneously accelerating the rollout and announcing a $9 million taxpayer-funded propaganda campaign to convince said taxpayers of the false claims of 5G safety four months prior to the conclusion of the inquiry. Conflict of interest? I think so. For more information on the subject, check out this short video from We Say No to 5G in Australia.